On July 19th, a surprising phone call recording came to light, revealing a conversation between Jun Hong Jun, the CEO of Attract, and An Sung Il, the CEO of The Givers. The discussion revolved around the sudden cancellation of the Barbie music video filming for 5050. The recording, which was made public by former reporter and YouTuber Lee Jin Ho, allegedly captures the CEO's conversation that occurred on June 20th, right after the decision was made to call off the Barbie music video shoot. In the recording, CEO Jun Hong Jun can be heard saying, CEO on, why shouldn't I proceed with the two Barbie music video? It would bring recognition to the group and to you. But then a lawsuit came in. Responding with a heavy sigh, Representative An Sung Il explained, First, I'll speak to the American side and later I'll talk to the four members, but I'll make sure to pass along the message to them and I'll step back from the project. CEO An firmly asserted his decision to step away from the project and added, I'll wrap this up first. I'll simply receive the song and hand it over to you. It would be best for me to avoid any further involvement. Before this revelation, the givers. The Nao, in association with CEO An, had issued an official statement on July 17th, claiming that CEO Jun had abruptly halted the filming of the Barbie music video on June 20th. CEO An had expressed serious concerns about potential damages and future legal actions from the American side, as well as worries about erosion of trust and reputation and negative impacts on the group's global career if the filming continued. In response to the released recording, Lee Jin Ho shared his insights on his YouTube channel, stating, if the music video had been filmed, it would have been CEO Jun alone who suffered. He further revealed, on June 19th, the members of 5050 filed an application for a provisional injunction to suspend the exclusive contract. At that time, the members highlighted issues with Attract's lack of transparency and their attempts to enforce schedules despite the members' reported health challenges. Forcing the video shoot would have given them grounds to terminate the exclusive contract. According to the latest phone call recording and the Kakao Talk conversation, CEO Jun had genuinely been concerned about the members' health and mentioned that the group would resume activities in July after their recovery. Lee Jin Ho then added, and guess who was the individual pressuring the group to perform despite their health issues, as claimed by the members? It was actually CEO An. Merci d'avoir regardé notre vidéo. Nous espérons qu'elle vous a été informative et captivante. N'oubliez pas de vous abonner à notre chaîne et d'activer la cloche de notification pour rester informé e de nos dernières actualités et contenus. Nous apprécions votre soutien et nous sommes impatients de vous retrouver dans notre prochaine vidéo.